Oh yeah, the extinguisher is mandatory on all cars in Norway, at least uh, cars you can live in. So on my car as well there is, of course, a 2 kilo mandatory fire extinguisher. This one is uh, was mounted under my seat here, but I want to use this space for a drawer, so I have to remove it. And I was looking for a new one. And then I discovered this tiny little baby. Mouse! Oh. The mouse extinguisher is a very small one, only 480 grams or something like that, which is amazingly nice compared to the big uh, 2 kilo that I have before. This tiny mouse extinguisher has the same capacity as the big 2 kilos uh, powder extinguisher, but this one does not harm anything. So the powder one is harming everything, you can't use anything afterwards because it's some acid inside that attacks metal and everything. This one leaves nothing. And it's, um, the extinguish time is approximately 10 seconds. Look at this. Looks like a torch. You can use it as a club if there are club button if someone and some thieves and enter your car. It's not that heavy, it's only 450 grams or something. 480 grams, yes, that is correct. Safety pull, you pull this one and you push this one afterwards and it will shoot smoke. amazingly nice and you get uh, this nice holder included in the kit so you can uh, install it wherever you like it fantastic <laughs> I really love this one and that's not all you can also if you have a boat or if you put it somewhere that is water like close to your sink at home or something you can uh, put it inside this very nice ooh, Very nice box. And let me see if I manage to open this one. And here we go. And here we have it. And bad preparation. It's like a glow. You see, there are uh, some grips for your hands over here, which fits perfectly on this, if you can see this. Very nice. Very nice indeed. <laughs> you can't help smiling. It also has a safety tab that tells you to pull. It's in Norwegian here, but um, yeah. So you can, so any, anyone that enters the car or the boat or whatever can understand how to release the, the lid cobbling. Yeah. That's also one excellent And there's one more thing. This one, they have a small, very nice item called a Stix. This one is a self-distinguish. It's self-distinguish. Well, when it's uh, get uh, 180 degrees, it will release the same smoke as this one. So this one is excellent to use in your uh, fuse box or fuse cabin at home. And they also can deliver this nice uh, dry bag for use at, uh, at sea, in open boats or something. And you can protect the excellent mouse. In some, in, 
inside the bag and you just pull the zipper and there it is waterproofed <laughs> amazingly nice huh? quick comparison two kilo heavy and uh, powder extinguisher and this nice uh, smoke 480 grams extinguisher doing the same job but uh, you still at least not in Norway and I think in the Nordic country this is mandatory so you just have to keep this in the car somewhere but this one is way easier to install somewhere around the cabin because you have to reach it in a sh short distance from your seat <laughs> nice <laughs> oh yes imagine if you have a gasoline balagon that is very prone to catch fire because of the bad fuel hoses then this one will be excellent to have inside the engine department the biggest advantage you get when you're using this on your engine especially those of you who have a gasoline engine which is very prone to catch fire because of the bad fuel hoses this one will not leave any residue the powder one we destroy the, mo the engine, the motor. So. This one is excellent to put somewhere close to the motor so it's easy to catch it to catch it to find it okay so there we have it mouse mini extinguisher doing the same job as the two kilo powder you get this waterproof holder to install close to the kitchen or in the boat this uh, sticks for your fuse cabinet at home and there are even screws to mount everything included that is the same on this one there was screws included so check out the website i will provide links for it uh, up in the corner and down below so uh, and a good idea is to check for prices because they vary vary from prices to very expensive to very cheap just a nice tip thanks for watching guys Hope you like it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.